Hey guys, um, I am actually editing this video right now uh, and I wanted to pop in to say that I didn't actually film an intro for this video. I think it was just so early in the morning when we got started that I completely blanked um, and forgot. So this is the intro. This day we started out super early and we're headed to Hollywood Studios with the hopes of rope dropping Mickey's Runaway Railway, which we did and it was super awesome. So the clips that you are about to see is us getting there and arriving and then experiencing Mickey's Runaway Railway for the very first time. It was absolutely amazing. So yeah, I just want to share that with you guys. So yeah, if you aren't already subscribed to this channel, definitely subscribe down below and and you can also follow me on Instagram if you like Disney content. I will be sharing a lot on there as I am moving to Orlando in T minus 77 days. So yeah, all right, enjoy. this here locomotive? Scooby, that seems like a lot of paperwork that I don't really want to do right Thanks. now. Thanks! Okay. Be back in a jiffy to pick you all up! <laughs> okay, I think you're going in. <laughs> and welcome to another beautiful day in Orlando, Florida. Today we are at Hollywood Studios for the deluxe resort extra half an hour in the morning. We use that time to go in Mickey's Runaway Railway. It is 8.57 in the morning and we're about to go in Tower Terror, which is my favorite ride because it has a 13 minute wait. It's 15 minutes, they just say 13 because it's more fun. <laughs> I am so excited because it's my absolute favorite. But I want to show you a long Hollywood Boulevard. They put up some Christmas decorations already. It's absolutely crazy to me that Christmas decorations are already going up. We saw some yesterday at Epcot and now here at Hollywood Studio. We can't even get to Halloween without it being Christmas. In just a few moments, the library doors in front of you will be opening. Please stand back from the doors as they will be opening toward you. Thank you. Tower Terror was absolutely amazing, so it's now time for Rock and Roller Coaster. It is only 9.15 a.m. and we've gotten three rides in and three of the best rides. We'll be leaving the park early, mostly because we have to do our COVID test later. They're not doing the pre-show. No pre-show. Just line. It's so weird to see the thing covered. There's 
rumors that they are removing Aerosmith from the run and they cover or changing the sponsor, but they covered up the big guitar. So we just have to go without it now. We are off to Galaxy's Edge now, so I'll try to show you as much as I can, but we're doing some secret stuff, so I'll find out eventually. Change of plans, we're going into Once Upon a Time because mom wants to do some shopping. So, mom might not have bought something, but I did. It's hard for me to go into the store without purchasing things. Good reason not to go into stores. It was something super unique and I haven't seen it literally anywhere or anyone wearing it, so I'm very excited. We are now on our way to Galaxy's Edge. Hopefully we can get there because like the park has become really big. It doesn't look like it right now, but it's become really busy. There's supposed to be like severe thunderstorms and potentially tornadoes this afternoon. So I'm guessing that everyone's here super early so that they don't have to be in that later. Star Tours is proud to introduce the Star Speeder 1000, the most Another change of plans. We're gonna take Star Tours on the way because it's a five minute wait, so we might as well. DJ Rex. Whatever cat is bad is mad. Now, this time, it's too hot. It's good for the top of the hat. 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 It's good what? Come on, say I, I love you. I love you. I know. Oh, yeah. Star Tours 1401, you are cleared for departure. 1401? That's us. We can't take off. The captain isn't on board. Don't seem to understand. I am not the captain. I am C3PO. 1401, cleared for takeoff. Contact departure on frequency 429. <laughs> Galaxy's Edge or Journey to Batuu, everyone's least favorite Sims pack. I love it though because I can be in Disney World from home. We came for Ronto Wraps. Um, I don't know if you can hear me. There's so many people because it's raining. But we got two regular and one breakfast. I'm very excited to eat them. It's raining, so we're going back to the hotel. Also, because we have to get back for our flight pre-tests. I don't know why it always rains when we're in Hollywood Studios, but it always does. What would you give the Ronto Wrap out of five quarts? Um, four. Four? Four. I give the regular three and a half, and the breakfast four and a half. See, I was an even four on both of them. I, I quite like them. Yeah. I quite like them too. They were they weren't outstanding. Any sausage roll is never going to be probably more than a four, but a hot dog sausage roll thing it was amazing. You heard it here first, folks. I don't know if these are actually new, but they have jasmine and Ariel is new emos. And just like that, we are headed out of the park for now, most likely for the rest of the day. But we got a lot done, and it's only 11:17 in the morning. I haven't updated you guys in hours because we came back to the hotel I was waiting for our COVID tests for the plane because someone was supposed to actually come here. They didn't. So it's now 4 o'clock and we have a backup appointment that we smartly booked at Walgreens which is a drive through I believe. Mm -hmm. And we gotta go to that <laughs> because no one ever came to test us here and there's like a whole story which I will tell you when we get back. Let's have fun now and go get COVID tested. Okay, um, there's gonna be a story time later, but we're at a second testing place to get more stuff so shoved up our ass. So, that's fun. Cheeky Philly. Cheeky Philly. Since I was a good girl, I'm getting a treat. I had dinner. We're at Disney Springs for a second and they're playing 
I can go to the distance. It's making me sad. Okay, hey guys, um, I'm at a coffee shop, so hopefully you can hear me. I never filmed an outro to this video, so I'm filming that now for you guys. Basically, with the COVID testing, we had gotten in touch with the company that was supposed to come to our hotel. They confirmed it and actually changed our time the day before. So we were at the hotel for when they were supposed to come. The woman who was supposed to come never showed up. We had her name and everything. We called customer service. They were offering like, a time the next morning, which wouldn't have worked because we might not get our tests back in time and stuff anyways it was a whole mess with that so after like waiting like three hours or something we ended up going to Walgreens which we did the tests as you saw at Walgreens they said it was gonna be a four to five business day return time on the tests so that wouldn't have worked because you need it to be 72 hours with a PCR test before flight um, to return back into Canada so then I panicked and went on to my phone and was researching different places and found a place that was reputable um, where you had to pay but we ended up paying like six hundred dollars or something to get PCR tests so we got a second nose swab and then we got Chick-fil-a which was as I said was my treat and we just shopped at Disney Springs and went home and went to bed because we had some big days previous to this if you haven't seen the vlogs go check them out if you aren't already subscribed subscribe down below it would mean a lot um, and help me out a lot and there's a new video coming out next week you can also follow me on Instagram which is gonna be up on the screen screen or in the description Description, and you can see all sorts of Disney photos and follow along as I move to Disney in the next little bit. You can also see a picture from this coffee shop. So yeah, see you in the next one. Bye.